Okay, so I've already applied my base. I just used the MAC Prep and Prime eyeshadow base. And now I'm going to add um, a white base to my lid and right under my brow bone. And I'm just going to use this NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk. So I'm going to put that right in the inner third of my eye. And then right under my brow bone. And I'm just going to blend that out with my finger. And you don't want to blend it out too much so that it goes away. You just want it to um, not crease. Just like that. And then before we put on any other eyeshadow, I'm going to put on a pink base. And I'm just going to use this MAC um, Metal X Cream Eyeshadow in Pink Platinum. And it looks like this. So I'm going to take that just on my finger and put it on the rest of my lid next to the white base okay so now that we have our base on um, I'm going to put a white eyeshadow on and this is Max White Frost eyeshadow and I'm going to use my MAC 239 I'm just going to put that right on top of that white base and pat it on on the inner third of the eye and a little bit in the inner corner And then also in the brow bone. And you want to blend that downwards. Okay, now I'm going to add a pink to the middle part of the lid. And I'm going to be using this, um, this color right here. And it is... Disco Pink by Clinique, and I'm going to use my 239 again that onto my brush and just pat it in the middle. And then sort of blend it in with the white by rubbing it back and forth and then taking the side with the white and then doing the same thing and then you kind of just have to work with it until it blends out the way you want it Okay, so this is what it should look like so far. Now I'm going to take um, MAC Stars and Rockets eyeshadow, which looks like this. And then I'm going to flip my brush over again to the white side, or the side that I used the white on. And take that, and then put it right next to that pink in like the outer third of the eye and blend that in a 
like that. Okay, now I'm going to take a blending brush and Beautiful Iris by MAC. And I'm just going to put that in my crease a little bit. Just so there's like a purple sheen to it. And then with the same brush, I'm going to take Parfait Amour, which is a darker purple, and just darken up that purple a little bit. Okay, and now just to darken up that outer corner, I'm going to take Max Passionate Eyeshadow with the same brush, and I'm going to put that right in the outer corner, really lightly. Okay, and I'm just going to fix my highlight again. So I'm taking that white frost eyeshadow and my fluffy Sonia Kashuk eyeshadow brush. I'm just fixing the edge of where I put that purple and blending it down. Okay, so this is what we have so far. Um, I'm just going to add some black liner to the top lid and waterline and then some lashes and I will be back to show you the final look. Okay, so this is the final look. I just added some black liner and lashes. And then, um, yeah, it's just a pink and purple, oops, sorry, um, Valentine's Day look. And it's good for the daytime because it's really light and it, but it's so like colorful because it's pink and purple <laughs> I don't know and then for my lips um, I have on the Maybelline Color Sensational lipstick in Make Me Pink this is the one that um, in the pink section that the model is wearing and then on top of that um, I have this Milani 3D Glitzy Glamour Gloss on top. And these are new. I just got them today. And today is Sunday the 31st. And um, I'm just saying that because I probably won't post this today. But I'm just filming it. So yeah. And I saw these and they were like so pretty. And this reminded me of Funtabulous from the MAC Dazzle Gloss collection. And so I went home and it's like a perfect dupe. Like look like... This one is a little darker, but I mean, it's pretty much the same thing. And they have four colors of these, and three of them, by memory, I know that they look exactly like three of the Dazzle Glasses. So, I'm going to go get some more of these and probably, or hopefully, do a review on them sometime this week. So, yeah, this is just, this is the final look. Um, I hope you guys like it and try it out for Valentine's Day. Thank you for watching.